Six Shooter Texan here. Today we're at the range of the Magnolia Misfits. It's a cowboy action shooting club. And uh, I belong to this this range. I don't actually shoot the cowboy action. But this is where I do a lot of my shooting for my power power guns, powder burners, stuff like that. It goes on quite a ways this way. Then you got a 22 range down on the other end. <clears throat> then down right here we have a area bench just for uh, the uh, high-powered rifles, 200-yard range, and then on the other side of that, a pistol range for your powder. Uh, anything bigger than a 22 long rifle. But today we're going to be shooting a contest called the lasso. If any, some of y'all may know what it, that means, but for y'all that don't, that's Long Range Air Gun Silhouette Shooting Organization, which has nothing to do with cowboy shooting. But we're going to give it a shot today. I'm going to do my version of it. We're going to do shoot at 50 yards, 100 yards, 150, 200 yards. And I'm going to be shooting a 8 by 10 inch plate that uh, gong that I made. Most of the time they're shooting a full size silhouette with an 8 inch kill zone on it. So we're just representing the kill zone today. The, the rules are basically you get two shots in 30 seconds. If you hit the kill zone on the first shot, you're done. You get maximum points. If you hit the animal, which we won't be able to because I only have an 8 inch gong, not a full animal. But if you hit the animal, you get a point and then you get your suck, be able to shoot the second shot and to hit the kill zone. But if you hit the kill zone the first shot, that's it. You got your maximum points that you can get out of the shoot. So let's get to shooting. All right, one thing I forgot to mention was in this competition, you're only allowed to use a shooting stick, shooting sticks, bipod, tripod, whatever you can like that but you can't shoot off a bench or anything like that this is kind of simulate hunting situations where you're in the field you see an animal and you got X amount of time to get a shot off at him so let's see if we can zoom in here see the target for the first first one it's gonna be right there that's my gong that I'm going to be shooting, and it's at 50 yards. All right, this uh, I have my phone set up over here, so as soon as I set the timer off, I got. 30 seconds to hit, hit the target. And on this first one, I'm not even going to use shooting sticks. I'm going to shoot it offhand at 50 yards. All right, here we go. Don't give you much time. All right. Hit it just about center, just to the left. All right, we're going to move it out to 100. Yeah, well, 
I'm back here at home on this one. The uh, 100 yard, something happened on the camera, didn't record the 100 yard target. But I'll show you later in the video at, at the hit. I did hit it in the first shot. So on with the rest of the video. All right, 150 yards. Well, missed that 150. Let's move it to 200. All right, 200 yard gun. I did forget to mention that you are able to uh, range find a, before you start the shooting, but you've only got the 30 seconds to do your two shots, so you better be ready. <clears throat> One shot, feel sweet. All right, Get this up over here. <clears throat> Thirty seconds isn't much time. You fumble a little bit, you're out. I haven't practiced much either at doing this. Shooting, actual setting, the t setting up on the target and, and getting off two rounds in 30 seconds. I haven't practiced that. I have been practicing off the bench and it shows I haven't practiced that much at 150. And that's the one I missed. When I took the second shot after the clock expired to empty the gun, I could see where it hit and I missed the target to the right by maybe a half an inch. It was dead center height, but just a little to the, to the right. Well, let's go down and look at the target. All right, here's the target. This was the 50 yard freehand shot the 100 yard shot and that's the 200 yard shot that ain't too bad there's where I'm shooting from definitely got my morning exercise doing all this walking 